I bet you didn't think we were, we were coming on, did you? I didn't know either. Walt, you like reading the comments. Nope. Listen, tonight is a special night. What's tonight, Walt? Friday. No. Tonight is us showing off the best offer sale, number 36. As a matter of fact, I'm going to try to fix this here. See, here it is here. This is the video you're watching. And I'm going to save it. And our visibility is good. It looks like we're airing. It is good. Up, oh, and we are. And we got three watching, Walt. Oh, God, only three here, Walt. Three. We only have three. This is a disaster. Count them no, three. We, we're late tonight. I three, know. Three, we're three, late. count them three. Walt, you got your big fat fink. Here we go. Driving wall cops. Listen, we have some, a lot of crap we're going to put up here. Uh, the purpose of this video. Hey, Ryan, how you doing, young man? Come walk, walk around here because I want you to know that tomorrow night, the TNT Amusements Best Over Sale 36 is in place. Okay? Now, that's me, and that's Phil, and that's his son, Nicholas who were here, believe it or not, two weeks ago. Yep. And now we, we waited, we skipped a week because we were so busy. I'm gonna show you how busy our shop is. We put up a bunch of stuff. Walt and I have been work, working feverishly, getting a bunch of crap up here. We still haven't picked everything out. Yep, yep, yep. And, and Walt, would you say the stuff we picked out is total crap? Of course, like always. Uh, March of Feeling is from Belgium, and Ken G is here, too. Hi to all. We only have nine watching, I guess. Here, only turn, nine. Here. Yeah, we'll turn over. Um, we actually been listing a bunch of stuff on eBay. Mm. My daughter uh, listed uh, another 150 <coughs> flyers. <coughs> we put some boards up. Desperately trying to get some stuff ready. Uh, tomorrow we have a strategic formation PCB, a Miss Pac-Man, a beautiful rebuilt Miss Pac-Man PCB, a running gun. Uh, we have some. Wait, what? What is this, Curdy? Curdy, now listen. We just had an adult party. Anticipate, Curdy. Um, and Curdy was upset because he's been out for a whole week. Do you know this is his first day back? It is Friday night. This boy hasn't been here since last Wednesday. The games he, are still in the same spot when I left. No, no, I, I can't get rid of this stuff. I, I can't work on this stuff fast enough. Look, you on, more, you more on junk. hoogies and you worked on pizza. All Look, week. Star <laughs> Tech journals, a whole year's worth. These are amazing. Uh, we have another and final tapper marquee. That's our last tapper marquee. Real glass one. We have eight back glasses. Uh, we have, uh, what else? Oh, we have, we're going to have three non-working boards. Here's a, we, these sold last time. We're going to do this again. Uh, 150 fluorescent starters for a fraction of what they cost. And these will work in any bulb, not just 15 watt or 20 watt. These will work from 4 watts to 40 watts. It's a special everything starter. We have a package deal on a whole bunch of brand new rubbers. Okay, the price is lower than you could ever imagine. Uh, Walt got together 100. Now these are different. These are 100 micro switch buttons. Brand new with the lock washer. They just need the micro switch. These are going to be so cheap, it's going to make your head swim. Brand new buttons. We have another working Street Fighter board, a NBA hang time piece, PCB board that works. Another one. Can you imagine, Walt, how many times can you get two in one? Yep. Only here at TNT. Too many. We're trying to get more stuff ready. Yep. Are we going to be able to, Walt? We probably get a few more that, things that tonight. Complete? I, I, you know what? Somebody asked for a Zaxxon. Okay. I don't know. I'm going to be able to get some more stuff. Come back here, Walt. Uh, we're not going to make a whole lot of videos tonight. John or uh, Steve is over here stumbling about. You see John. 
two useless men. You recognize the boy? He's cleaned himself up. Yeah, I took a shower. No, I meant the beard. <laughs> <coughs> Steven, remember the uh, the brown jukebox from our last video? I uh, worked on that. Did you do it yourself or did you have this lad here help you? I did it myself. He did a beautiful job on that door. He's a man of all talents. Yeah, Renaissance man. He does just about anything. Right now, he's using a capacitor lead to pry out a blackhead in his hand. Right? Just a scab. Just a scab, okay. Well, you use what's handy. Uh, you know, you know what you do with these? You stick these in the socket. <coughs> Power outlet? Yeah. And you wait well, and on see? On a light switch. Oh, okay. Okay. I was going to say, if you slid that in to a socket with your fingers... No, you put it in there like that, on the light right. switch, and then you turn the light switch on. Yeah, right, but why don't you just take the live outlet and stick it in that socket right now with your fingers? Nah. Yeah. We're going to take these boys out and stuff them. He's passing out. Somebody had a long day at work. I had my second shot today. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, my, I go in next week. Mine's next mm, week. tired. No, I'm, you probably have a sore arm, right? I guess. Maybe tomorrow it'll be sore. I think it's the next day. Well, we're going to walk around and show them some stuff. Some crap. <coughs> second shot. Another tired. This pack man came in. This is going to be a multi cade. Curdy is working on this Batman Forever, and it has this beautiful color display in it. Look at that. And so she's a beauty uh, The PPB board, every fuse holder was broken. Not anymore. Yes. Repaired for you. Every single fuse holder, and the guy had soldered. He actually soldered the fuses onto the holder, so you couldn't take the fuses out. Oh, fix this! And that's just what he did. He fixed it. Fixed it. Yes. Pretty temporary. Yes. That was it. Well, no, no, that was permanent. permanent. The guy thought he was doing a service. A he service thought. he was. Scotty here. Okay, this is almost done. Scotty's here. What? Scotty. <laughs> he went to Disney <laughs> World. Scotty went to Disney World. Uh, but he did finish all three shuffles. So we have another gold mine, another strike master, and another top dog. Uh, this is Doug's. It's finished. It's incredibly beautiful. Black Knight. Um, we're waiting on a magnet, uh, a chip for the magnet board. Stupid chip. There's a guy up in Canada that sells it. That gal blew up. So we're in the process of fixing that. Is that the good That level. Yeah, we could try this on the other one. Yeah, try it, yeah. Uh, we have... This is a missing pack now. That we're finishing. This is going out. Let me find the right bulbs. Or bulbs. I'm trying to use up my incandescent bulbs. So you we buy, have a bunch it's all of I buy. What? It's all I buy. What do you mean it's all you buy? You should be buying LEDs. Nah, garbage. Garbage? It's like electric cars, garbage. Oh, look. Almost done. Uh, advertising. Actually, Curdy. I have to call him. <laughs> yeah. Um, Jimmy? So, that's almost done. Uh, I'm trying to think of what else is almost done. We're doing a lot, aren't we? Uh, let's go over here. Oh, the taxis. That's almost done. We have to do something with that, uh, that Star Wars video. Can you take the back door off? Um, I have to do a change a part on it, see if it's going to fix it. Sure, I'll do it. Let me just stop the other five projects. Uh, I may have to call the guy. Come up, come up front. I want to show you some things up here. Oh, before I go, let me just check and see if there's anybody I need to. Um, Phil sent us money. It was very kind of you. Today? Uh, yeah. 
Okay. Mike and Steve and Enrico and Glio and Ostra Bear. Oh, I missed a lot of. Oh God, you haven't been telling me they've been calling. Yeah. You're supposed to tell me they're typing. Ryan's birthday too. It's this Sunday. Gold Wings is here. A night horse. Actually, Gold Wings. Oddly enough, I we we uh, I had a used Gold Wings ramp. That I just lowered the price on eBay. Um, you like my jorts, don't you? Do you think they would sell, Ryan? My best offer. We just sold the Gladiator's Pinball next door. Yes, and I also just sold the uh, Stun Runner. For a bargain based Good. on Stun Runner. Mm -hmm. That is nice. one. So I have to still run the credit card, but it's not a busy thing. We're so busy. Come on, Because we're not going to go much longer. <clears throat> we're doing this mainly to get she has to tune in um, to tomorrow night's show. You have to register. I had wanted to show you this. This, this really hurt me. We took this Kings of Steel and trade. Okay? So I looked at the play theory. Look, come close. So it's got wear here. It's got wear right there, which we could touch up. But it has wear here. See this wear here? Okay. The problem is that the guy stuck the overlay on top of the wear. So the overlay is goes from here and over and down. And then now this doesn't have the overlay, so we can touch all this up. I, I couldn't believe this. I mean, they actually slapped the... That! I found the overlay! And then they stuck it down on top. Oh, Let's stop uh, the show. It's on top of the wire? Yeah, it's on over the wire. Dude, you just saw it. Uh, I plugged the monitor in on the Star Wars. No, uh, there's a transistor. 3792, the one on the far left. He thought you may know where those transistors are. Do you? Oh. Stephen, or, uh, what's his name? Jimmy, Jimmy thought you would know where they were. Oh, God. I'll kill him later. I'm going to kill him later. Who? Jimmy. Oh. I have a lot of people I want to kill. Mm. Uh, you know, I don't think we did sell a lot of these games. We moved a bunch out. Somebody bought the haunted house. I just haven't had a chance to get it out yet. Uh, and then, of course, the stun runner. You know, this has just been a fixture here all this time. Yeah, so that sold on our sale for eight hundred. So somebody gave me anything about. Oh, we can lock the front now. These people left. We have an adult party here tonight. <laughs> the timer off now. Timer is off. Overhead lights off, but see, it's still nice and bright in here, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah, okay. The door is open sign down. Yes, because it is not. And then we'll lock the lockdown bar. This way nobody can surprise us. Mm. Um, <laughs> did we change the pinball in there? I don't think we did. We got in a Millionaire. So we just got this in. And we sold that to God. 28. It's got a 28 year sticker on it. I know you can't see it. Uh, this is Jeff's. Jeff's going to hate me, but Jeff in Florida. I, I had. Everybody was out this week. It was an awful week for people. So this is going to go out Monday or Tuesday to Jeff. And then I sold a second one. Now look at this, we just got this brand new HD3 in. It just arrived from, from the factory. And look, there's some kind of fog in it. Can you see that? Yep. Right here and here. It's a plastic one. Yeah, it still has a, no, it's not plastic, it's just, so uh, I, I couldn't okay, believe it. Okay. So I called the company. Wednesday, I sent them pictures. I haven't heard a word. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's sort of like getting a defective play field you never hear. Yeah, so exactly. Yeah, you know. I don't know. Oh, we did sell this. It's actually in the video. Uh, I, I made a video and I never published it because I sold them. These are all games sold. Uh, I have 83 System 1 logic boards and we sold them all in one package deal. There's another stack of them over here. Oh, I've got to show you this. I actually had this out. I'm going to show you this in the sale. <coughs> this is some bozo's idea of fixing his Stargate power supply. Rather than put the right part in here, he came up with this. I'll fix this! And he did. He did. Isn't, isn't that a beautiful... I mean, that is... That, now, my competitor would do this because he's so stupid. But I'm not. We did, we did get a whole stack of all tech boards in we got a whole bunch of brand new old tech. These are the lamp drivers. And they're going into the projects that are going on. And look at what some bozo did to his game. This is a Strike Master. And the guy said it stopped working. Well, it sure did. The board is unrepairable. The acid has gone through and completely obliterated the board. So this is going to be sold. We're going to do a... Um, I'm going to post some of these junk. Yeah, somebody may want to have a hand at fixing it, but we sure as hell are. Junk. J U N K with a capital K. What are we doing there? Oh, here, let me look real quick. This is a real sure video. I had, look what I had worked on for you guys. <coughs> hey, Arthur. Uh, we do ship, we ship uh, everything. We can ship to anywhere in the world. Uh, uh, yes, we, we can ship games. We can ship parts, anything. Here's the project I got ready for you guys. <coughs> it's right here. And um, let me see if it'll play. It's not happy. So here's the project here. And it runs almost, um, almost an hour. It's not even finished. Uh, but th this is what's playing up here. Uh, so I'm still working on the elements of it. Adrian from Poland. Adrian sent me all this Let coffee, so that's how we're going to open the video. But this is the video. It's going to show the project of the Pinbot and how beautiful Pimbot is. See there, see there, isn't, isn't that beautiful right there? It's a beautiful game. Barry Osler's uh, best game. Uh, I'm sure he disagrees, but uh, we're gonna give away a t-shirt next time uh, f from, uh, see it says, stay hard, my friends. That's the hard top. That was cute. Then we're going to show you a very rare six million dollar man. The first hundred and ten, we found out had a special thing that no other pinball had for another two and a half, almost three years later. So you're going to see this uh, game. Um, uh, we have. <clears throat> um, I have three or four battle zones next door, by the way. Um, so I do have, I, I haven't been able to get to them. I have all these people that want them. I, I get, you know what? We are just so busy. People hate me. Super off-road. Oh, it had a super pack man we sold as is. And look, it was customized for the guy. See? We had the guy sign it. We took it down to... A really nice neighborhood in Philadelphia, and we asked them to sign the machine for us. Hmm. Not say. There's S -S Snuzz. See, Snuzz wrote right on the side, isn't that? See, mm -hmm. Snuzz. That was nice, though, wasn't it? 
What makes it authentic? God, I'm so, I'm so awful. Oh, and uh, the I think the video ends with a Judge Dredd. We're actually delivering tomorrow a Judge Dredd. <sighs> I'm so tired. Um, anyway, um, oh, Phil, how you doing? And, Str and Stringer Films is here in Astro Bear. Uh, Thanks. We're, uh, we're, Anyway, as you can see, ship, no, shipping is not expensive. Uh, I can ship, you turn the camera to me, I can ship to Canada, to almost any place in Canada for about 475. Not every place, but almost any place. I can ship a game to Australia, to Melbourne for like 650. I can ship to, to England for 600, to Denmark. I, I, it's not that expensive. It really isn't. I mean, it costs me 400 to ship a game to California and just like 200 more or so to ship it to Australia, which is another 2,000 miles away. It's like unbelievable. Ah, do you want to buy that? I didn't think so. No, I was looking about making the handlebars. Oh my God, are you kidding? Paperboy handlebars? Do you know how hard that is going to be to make it? No. Look, look how many people can say they have a Galaxian logic board at their feet. Now look what I had to order. See right here, come in close. The board won't run. These two capacitors are so dried out because this board's from 79. So 43 years later, the caps have died. Oh, bad, slow, ugly death I made. This is not a long one, and I know Walt's already tired. We already have 63 watching, so, and it is late. Uh, we don't ship anything COD. Ah, no. Has to be prepared. No CODs. Yeah, I can just see that happening, right? And, oh, I've changed my mind. <laughs> After he takes it. I've changed my mind. No, no. No, we're not that stupid. Well, I should make you the star of the show. You'll be my eye candy. Uh oh, he's, he's flustered. I, we're gonna we're gonna feed him. We're gonna feed the boy. He's hungry. Anyway, uh, no, no. I had a guy uh, call me today. And they, they asked, do you have this game, do you have that? And when I finally settled on the game that I had, I said, I just need a, a deposit. He said, oh, I'm not ready to buy this. I just want to know if you had it. I said, well, I won't have it. If you, you know, I won't have it in a week or two. Oh, uh, this is for next year. Just wasting my time next year. I'll just do my shopping today. Yeah. Thank, thanks a lot. I appreciate that. Yeah. So another another lady called me up about getting a monitor fixed and a logic board fixed. Okay. And he says, and your my husband worked for you for about five or six weeks. She said his name. And I said I don't remember him. He says, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then at the time these these we we, we wanted to get these things fixed and you were going to fix them, but uh, it was. It was September 10th, and then September 11th happened. And I said, oh, okay. I said, and? And he said, well, we're now ready to fix this. So first of all, I can't hear you real well. I, I said, there's some kind of noise or air or something. He says, well, I'm driving. With the windows down, she's driving down the highway. She says, you know, I think I'm gonna call Todd and tell him that 20 years ago, I wanted to get these games fixed, and now we're ready. And I just couldn't think of anything else to do while I was driving. I'll just call him. Do you remember me? No, I don't. It was 20 friggin' ass years ago. I don't remember you or your stupid boards or anything. No, I didn't actually say it that way. But boy, I wanted to. <coughs> I said, will you get yourself together? When you get when you can call when you don't have the windows rolled down, when you can call from a house phone. 
I said that maybe we can send the stuff out and get them fixed. See? Do you get calls like that? Hi. Say good night. I just watched your video, and I want to know if you can tell me how to fix the, the same game. Yeah, sure. Did you reheat all the boards? What boards? Did you change the capacitors? What capacitors? I I'll tell you what to do. Just go up to the game and do this. And it'll be fixed. Robbie, you came! Where have you been, Robbie? You don't watch any of my sh game videos. Guess what? My brother's little grand boy, grandson, uh, last day of school today, and he was on stage, he was as cute as a bum. What a cute little fella. We we're very proud of him. We we're very proud of that little fella, Robbie. I'm very glad about that. We're, we're going to sign off, but I want to show you one last thing. Next weekend, come close. I brought this up on the screen. If any of you are local, now Jillian is coming down next weekend They're gonna for the best offer sale on Saturday, and then on Father's Day, the last day, Tammy is doing a show. She's playing Juror 3 in 12 Angry Jurors. It used to be called 12 Angry Men. And they changed it so they could add in uh, women. Now, if you're familiar with the, uh, the uh, show, 12 Angry Men was in the 50s. It starred Henry Fonda. And 12 jurors heard a, a murder case where they said this was a Puerto Rican man killed his grandfathers and they were trying to convict him and they heard all the evidence they went in the jury box and 11 of the 12 said he was guilty but the 12th guy was Henry Fonda and he said not guilty and then the rest of the movie was a 90 minute movie Henry Fonda convinced each juror why he probably couldn't have killed him with different different pieces of evidence that were presented to everyone and the last man was Lee J. Cobb, who said he was guilty and he wasn't going to change it. And he was guilty because he was Puerto Rican. That was the reason. And at the very end of the movie, they convinced him to change his mind and not to convict him based on race. That was in the 50s. Isn't that something? So anyway, if you want to come and see it, we're going to go on Father's Day, June 20th at 1 p.m. It's free going to be presented in the park, Hyde Park, it's near uh, TNT Amusements, Isn't and you can color? join us. Isn't it in color? It's live. If you want to go to the website, it's Town and Country yeah, Players nice. in Hatboro, PA, and you can register for a, a blanket and a, a tote bag, too. Uh, they're doing it free because it was originally presented on an outdoor stage because of COVID. They didn't know it was all going to be cleared up by now, where they would have played it on their regular uh, production stage. <sighs> anyway, thanks for watching. Did you have fun? I did. And Becca and Jeff say, I'm awesome. When do you plan on doing it after retirement? Well, I am retiring. I am closing TNT. And we actually have the date I'm going to give you the date. It's here it is. It's August the 10th, 2050. You guessed it. I'm closing down forever. No, I'm not. Dipwad. That's only that's only 29 years from now. No, I'm 65. So I'll be 90. I'll only be 94. I want to I want to relax. Starting at 94, I want to relax. Didn't Frankie Goes to Hollywood have a song called Relax? Yes, they did. Relax. Don't do it. What? How long have I been on? 30. Oh, here it is. 29. Look, I, this doesn't like Curdy Birdie. It says the stream started 20 frigging at 20. Say it. <laughs> I almost said it. I could run the ending though. Here, come over here. I want to run this, and this will. This is how we're gonna end. Um, I think.
think this is the right footage. Let me just see. Is this in here? Oh, there, you know what? There's no sound on this. Um, yeah, the soundtrack is in here. I didn't get the... No, no, you're going to go out with us. It's too late. It's 10.30. Oh, it's midnight tonight. It doesn't... The, the computer doesn't like a bigger picture. So we're copyrighted. You can use my footage. If you want to use my footage, if you ask me for it. Okay? And Nick is getting his black hole in tomorrow. I just thought of something mean. Thanks for watching. Please tune in tomorrow. Later in the week, next week, I'll have a live video. Can do you see that X button? An X button on that wall? Yep. Can you push it with your finger? Goodbye. 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 And then hit done. Did you hit done?